coach. He was, uh, you know, really efficient. Um, not not a real strong win tonight, but he was putting the ball five yards deep in the end zone. Yeah. So far this year, the Sharks have done a really, really good job, like you said, on the special team side. I mean, Gilbo comes in. I know it's only five punts through five games, but averaging like 43 yards a punt. So Gilbo's done a great job in the kicking game and the punting game as far as flipping the field, pinning team, team, teams back. Uh, he's only got an opportunity for one field goal, but he's one for one on field goals. So having a kid like that who truly is a specialist, and that's all he does, is really good to have. Set the hole, Gilbo to kick. Kick is up, kick is good. And that That's kicks on the track. Gilbo punts it over his head. Babino runs back to receive it, gets dragged back, met at the second he caught it. Braden, Positive game for the Sharks. Braden Gilbo able to pin the opposing offense inside the 20 again so he's two for two on that for the year great punt again but you know I got to give Gilbo a compliment right there he's been able to flip the field it's only his 12th punt on the year he's done a really good job of flipping the field it's official rule now. but great punt great. by Gilbo dropping him inside the 15 Offense back at their own 10 yard line is a huge play on special teams. Counts inside of the 10. Down at the 7. The air on Delta Fabacher. Gilbo set to onside kick to himself. To himself. And they dropped. Hitting the screenplay for 61 yards and a touchdown. Gilbo kicks off. That ball does sail out the back of the end zone for a touchback. Six and number four, I believe, Joni Martin. That is going to be over the head of Babineau. Touchback. Yeah. 